All right, today I'm gonna to show you how to make a green drink. We drink these every morning, and, and although I love them, my kids think they're tolerable, but they have gotten used to it. So um, right now I have two cups of water in my Vitamix, or you can use a regular blender, anything will work. Um, the class that I had taken, uh, the health food class that I had taken said that you wanna mix use different greens every day so you don't get an allergy, liver allergy, or um, this is bok choy, is what I had in my fridge. You can use spinach. Um, this is a really cool kale that I found at the store, and um, it's called Lacinto Tuscan Kale. So it's different than the other kale I think most people that I'm used to seeing. And the, you know the regular curly kale so these are just what I have in my fridge now I think the best green that doesn't taste as bad is the spinach and um, we also I also use collard greens Swiss chard do not use mustard greens they are terribly spicy um, a peppery flavor so what I do is so I have the two cups of water and all this, this is my last of my Swiss chard, so I'm going to mix them here. Sometimes I, if I have a little bit, I will mix it. I have this, the Lacinto kale, and you just kind of pack it in there, you know, like that. And then, if I really, I don't use this every time, but if I really want um, it super healthy, I use this Super One Food from Life Tree Wellness. And I'll just put like a scoop of it in here. And that, it does make it really pretty green flavor. And then um, I'll put these uh, chelated minerals, fulvic acid from Life Tree Wellness as well. Um, you can look online and, and I just pour about a tablespoon. So this usually feeds our whole family. The, with two cups of water and then it'll make enough for everyone to have some. Then I'll do a, use a banana for sweetness. Okay, And then for protein I'll add either flax seed, um, chia seeds, I'm going to put some hemp seeds in here. And I got these at Costco. They're the cheapest that i found. These can get pretty expensive. So. I just kind of just put a few in like that. Kind of gives it a nutty flavor. And then, oh, frozen. So then I just get the frozen berries from Costco. And I'll do a scoop of one cup of blueberries. And then you can obviously, you know, you can put more frozen fruit in it the thicker you want it. You want more of like an ice cream thickness. And then a cup of strawberries. And if you're doing um, this with, for kids, definitely put blueberries because then it turns it purple so it's not green and you can't see anything. And then so what I'll do is I'll put this just on my blender and blend it up and it'll be ready to go. So I'll spare you hearing the blending noise, but that's, that's it. And that's how I do my green drinks every morning. So enjoy.